The Creator created a desire. That desire is the only desire that was created. There weren't several desires created. One will to receive. That was created by the light to begin with. And if that desire is working in a way that it wants to absorb to itself fulfillments, which we call food, sex, money, honor, power, knowledge, it doesn't matter how we call them, but it wants to receive fulfillments and be fulfilled that way, then it's already occupied, it's already filled then we have to empty it and then a person feels despair, emptiness, helplessness, no reason to live, there's no point in life. He starts asking, what is the point in life? And from feeling, what is the point in life? That he has nothing to be fulfilled with, he begins to think from within, from something that awakens within him that it's possible to fulfill himself not by way of reception, that, that way is, it's impossible, but in bestowal there is also pleasure. And that is a great thing to learn. It happens by the light that reforms. It's so strange, it's so weird, it's so different, and it's not supported or justified by the environment. It's not appreciated, it's not respected, no one gives you medals for it. And it was done like that deliberately, that the importance of bestowal, of the ability to be fulfilled by a bestowal, to achieve infinite fulfillment, to feel eternal life if you're working in bestowal, that is all hidden, and that was done deliberately in order for us to reach that easily, because otherwise our will to receive would also chase those pleasures of bestowal, as long as it enjoys. Just like Bala Sulam says, it's like a thief running together with everyone and screaming, catch the thief. This is how we would behave. And this is why it says the empty voids within you will be filled with mitzvot, meaning precisely a person who is empty, who feels that he is nothing, that he is worthless. He feels that he has nothing, that he's inferior to everyone. As it says, we have no deeds within us. So he starts changing himself, understanding, realizing that it is true, it is correct, this situation, it's a good state, where if he now feels empty, that is actually a point from which he can start relating to the fulfillment differently, to the type of fulfillment that he will feel. Instead of Malchut, he will raise Malchut to Bina, that is, he will start receiving pleasure from bestowing, that is called raising Malchut to Bina.